Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you. If you want to design a movie poster and you want to sell in a marketplace like Freepik and Adobe Stock, so this video is for you. I'll show you how to make this movie poster and how to sell it in Freepik and how to prepare the file for the Freepik. So let's start the tutorial. If you're new in my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications. I'm using here the mid journey and already I made a lots of movie poster uh, like uh, templates without text. So text is in my hand or your, your hand and the thing is the manipulated photos and action type photos is too difficult and AI is saving our time in this point. Here already I made lots of lots of things which is like a action type movie poster and other stuffs. So here I'm using the prompt like that and this prompt is you can emphasize or you can just uh, use this prompt or you can just use and modify the prompt. Suppose I want to use this prompt here already I made lots of action type so this one and use the prompt. By the way, I'm using the Mid Journey Alpha and if you don't have the Mid Journey Alpha, uh, you can use the Discord version. You can get the same result in the Discord. The main thing is that this parameter and girl movie blank poster template action superhero super action hero. So I'm just deleting this portion and then if you enter this and it will take another prompt or the generation started already it will generate some new or fresh movie poster background which is uh, without text and we'll use the text according to our preferences and the other stuffs in the meantime i'm in a free peek and searching over here movie poster so just press the enter and already I filtered here the PSD because of the PSD is more reliable and easy to edit. So here are lots of movie posters. So this one, uh, this sort of movie poster or many more. Actually those are the top or top downloaded movie poster. Already they just give in here is another option ai generated if you press the ai generator only ai generated it will show you the ai generated movie posters which is really amazing so here is this type of action type movie poster you can download and here are another one another one which is real movie poster so this one this one those are like movie poster this one is the, the war type movies so these these and lots of movie posters like that so they provided us this sort of movie poster and this this one is the actual action type movie poster this one is like a retro type and this one is another superhero type so we'll use that how to do that here here is a download button you have to download this one so we are saving this poster so i have another software which is the heat power photo enhancer choose the file so already i downloaded this png and open it up this png i will have to make the jpeg version so here is a settings before that go to the general option i don't want to face retouch or face mode and going to the settings from here where i want to save this enlarged photo just original path and the version or the export format which is the jpeg and here is the pixel so this is the most important part if your photo is three not 300 dpi it don't uh, accept by the free pick and hit the ok button and then export so here it will take a little bit of time and it will export like that okay after that we'll go to the photoshop and after that going to the file and going to the open option so we enlarged our photo which is these and the jpeg version and open it up so already opened in photoshop now time to manage the layers and everything according to the free pick so 
here unlock this layer right press and convert to smart object and provide here bg bg for the background and after that you can write text over here write, write text over here uh, one thing is that you can write only the demo text not the real text because of when your user downloading your template they will have to edit this version fine going to the text tool and just select once the demo text will appear you can change the color like a white and press ctrl or command t or here the font i'll make the 150 that's bigger and i'll make it 100 is good that's good and i'll write here movie poster or movie whatever so movie is good for me and make the font size bigger or you can just make it bigger like that so that is the name of the movie so make the alignment properly in the middle that's good and now right press and blending options from here use the drop shadow a little bit if you want so like that if you want you can use the gradient overlay so you have to choose the gradient overlay from here i'm using like a purple pink orange uh, greens grays from the grays here are some like that which is the silver one so i would like to use that and hit ok that's good and again in a text tool or type tool select once over here coming soon that's good and this text will be smaller how to do that you can decrease the font size like that not too much it will be 48 is good that's fine and place over there or you can make it proper alignment in the middle so control or command a for selecting all the stuffs select the layer and here is the middle alignment from left to right that's good and for the deselect press control or command d it will deselect and the same like a uh, gradient if you want to use over here select the previous layer and copy the layer style and paste the layer style over here this process is making or just you can copy the all effects from the previous layer you can paste it in a present layer now making in a middle alignment that's good and the footer of the movie how to do that before that we have to change the location like this that's good and after that we'll go to the text again and just drag over there so after dragging that you'll get the lots of text over there i'll make the uh, font size smaller like uh, 11 or 12 this is too much small and i'll make it 16 is good okay you can increase according to the preferences suppose i want to make it 24 that's good and hit the tick button that is the footer text if you want you can change up the font and everything so i want to make the footer in a downside that's good and make the alignment into the middle that's fine and now time to add some cast and crew like uh, now who just acting in this movie so taking this coming soon things Ctrl or command J, Ctrl or command T, taking this into the upper side. That's fine. And providing the low rim. That's fine. And it could be the name. And press alter option button to make another copy. Like that. And it will be ipsum so that is not a actually name that is the demo uh, demo text so here all the text you can make another group ctrl command g just write over here edit text okay right press and make it another uh, color of the layer or group so you can save this one into your directory like movie poster template that's good that is our psd and we need to 
use the preview image how to make the preview image go to the file and go to the save as options and going to the save as and make it jpeg make sure that the name should be same and save this one use jpeg it could be like uh, upper than the five uh, 500 kb and you can make it not more not more than like 2 2 mb saving that out and let's see what we done in our directory one is our preview image which is the jpeg version and another one is the psd version you can you can upload these two things in your free pick so i'll show you how to use the proper tagging and proper uploading in a free pick in a next video so until the next video is signing out today stay safe stay healthy keep me in your prayers and bye bye